How's it going, everybody? Uh, <clears throat> reason for today's video, I wanted to wish everyone a happy uh, Thanksgiving, and uh, hope you uh, enjoy it with your family and all that. Uh, this year, I'm going to stay home more likely, and there's a couple reasons for that. Right now, one, uh, <laughs> if you're if you uh, on my Facebook at all or talk to me personally uh, I kind of have a car right now <laughs> but uh, I'm driving the work truck and uh, what I'll do is I'll put some pictures like up here somewhere of uh, the condi current condition of the car uh, I don't think it's drivable. The car's well over 20 years old. Someone uh, hit it while it was parked. Well, it didn't really hit it. They, uh, the way the guy told me, he parked beside it, and when he went to pull out, he uh, the steps on his bumper caught and pretty much ripped ripped about almost half of the bumper off it stopped right where the the license plate bracket for the front was uh, driver side headlights completely destroyed the center bar grill slash light you looking in the truck? anyway the windows right there uh, the center bar grill slash light thing that's all broke the passenger side headlight the brackets that you adjust the angle with light those are broke so that's just flapping there uh, not moved it yet it's pretty much still sitting where it's parked. I did a little bit of searching. Uh, my old wagon is a 93 Sable, Mercury Sable. That, uh, if I remember right, it books for like five to eight hundred bucks. It's got about 164,000 miles on it. And looking up some parts online, cost is around $400. Bucks. That's not counting labor. Uh, they told me to take it, get some estimates which this happened Tuesday today I'm recording this on Thanksgiving Day so this happened last Tuesday and I've <laughs> I've been driving the work truck for the last two days that's another reason why I'm kinda staying home I don't really wanna burn up gas and trying to conserve money so, anyway, I'm ready for November to be over. It can end any time now. <laughs> Let's see here. And it's, it's almost a year to the day when the radiator blew in, the, in said car. So I'm starting to get to the point where November's not a good month for me. So I'm kind of at the mercy of the insurance company of the other guy. It was it was a company truck that did it. Uh, the guy was nice enough to reach out to me and tell me, "Hey, I'm the one that did it. I've already talked to my boss." And we've talked to their, our insurance company. So 
The only problem is if they basically give me face value with a car, I'm that's going to leave me carless. So, I'll keep you guys posted on what's going on and uh, how everything's going. So, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, again, no bike updates this week either because uh, apparently my life's a roller coaster right now. Thanks for watching, guys.